Keith K here. Listen, yeah, beautiful day in Pittsburgh. I got out uh, for a couple hours, and uh, uh, I've only done about uh, two or three digs, and hey, I'm on to a mercury dime. Um, trying to zero in on it so you can see it. Looked like 1920 to me. That's good. <laughs> Not too deep either. Hey, I might get lucky, who knows. Uh, let's see if we can't find some more. Keith K here. Hey, it's been about uh, about an hour now and I'm over my second silver of the day. I'm hunting one of the old parks. Uh, it's just, you come back to the old parks because they're really never hunted out. And uh, I, <laughs> this thing gave a, a kind of an ippy sign and yet when you look at it, it's it's uh it's a barber it's a barber dime um from what i could see before it looked like 1902 and uh it's a dirty buddy but uh it'll clean up nice um very exciting that's that's multiples listen i want to take a moment though uh to uh give a little shout out to a, a guy you may not be subscribed to but if you would wouldn't mind go ahead and subscribe to mr two smoker Mr. Two Smoker, and the reason I'm saying that is this is the guy that I sold my e-track to, and uh, he started the year on fire this year. Um, he was over 100 silvers last year, and uh, trust me, he's on fire. Um, he hunts south of the city, and uh, we're just, uh, you know, just can't meet up too often, but uh, I'm anxious to go, uh, go down his way. Maybe I can find some silver down there, too. Mr. Two Smoker, stand by. Keith K here. Hey, listen, my day is going pretty good. Got two, two silver so far, and uh, I got myself one of my old favorites, a sex token. Um, listen, uh, Tulsa Pool Tab Finder, Aaron, you put this on your to get list. To get, yeah, you want to you want to try to find one. Well, listen, buddy, maybe I'll have to send you some. But you clean off a coin and you see nothing but boobs. Hey. <laughs> How sweet is that? Um, you got a token that had a dinosaur on it. I get a token that has some boobs on it. I'll trade you maybe. Stand by. <laughs> Keith K here. Home from the hunt. And uh, quite a few finds are down there uh, right now. And um, I had a great day. I mean, the weather finally turned in Pittsburgh. Um, I was able to get out. Um <laughs> Listen, when you're able to find silver, you're feeling good about yourself. And I feel good today. Um, well, I have had a couple of outings this year. Um, but really, the the nice weather is, has been far and few few days in between. So, let's, uh, let's see what I got. Okay. Um, the, the batteries. You know, now we're finding cell phone batteries and everything else. <laughs> good tones, but... Uh, not the stuff we want. Keys, I always find keys. But here's an interesting one. Um, this one here, uh, it's not open at the end. It looks like there may have been something there that broke off. But kind of like a skeleton key. And uh, all the other good stuff. I find a, a coin from the year 2100. A futuristic coin. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Um... A copper ring, uh, Canadian. Look at that Canadian, 1965. Them babies scream. I, I, you know, you, you get a, a hit on a Canadian penny, and uh, you know you got something, <laughs> something below the coil that's screaming at you. And let's see, I got a thimble. I got a button. There's something on the button. I don't think it's an old button, but you never know. Um, look at this. Uh, this tin lid. Uh, designs all around. Unfortunately, it's been in the ground too long to make out what the heck it went to, but it's kind of neat. Tin lid. There's a ring. 14 karat gold filled. Um, I actually didn't find out today. I found that the other day whenever I was out uh, for a little while. The, the day that I had no really good finds. So I saved that one. Uh... Five cents, W-H-W, -W. some sort of play money. 
a little helmet, uh, Chicago, <laughs> I don't know, and uh, wheat pennies. I want to show you something about a wheat because um, I like digging wheat pennies. We, we, we find a lot of them here in Pittsburgh and uh, our parks are more or less loaded with, with wheat pennies. Uh, you're finding wheat, you can start to find silver. And um, the one thing about a wheat is uh, there are now, uh, yes there's been for a while, wheats that are over 100 years old. And this is one of them. 1909, I hope you could see that. Uh, first year of the wheat penny and uh, it doesn't have the VVD on it um, I was hoping but hey listen 1909 that's a good wheat there we go <laughs> I got a sex token it's heads I win the other side might as, well, might as well show it to you right yeah okay heads I win tails I lose you lose Somebody loses. Yeah. Uh, anyhow, I don't know why it is I always find them, but I always do. Um, nice. And finally, the prizes. This is uh, 1902 Barber Dime. Great, great find. Uh, Century coin. Happy to have it. And uh, then an old Mercury Dime, 1920. A little beat up, but uh, hey, listen, I had a great hunt today. Um, I feel good. <laughs> I'm going to rest well tonight. And uh, hey, if the weather breaks for tomorrow, I'll be out there again. But we're, we're having crazy weather, man. It, it, you can get up to 50, and you get down into the 20s at night. And tomorrow, I don't know if it's even going to get to 40, but another cold front's coming through, so... Let's see what happens. Listen, thanks. Uh, th thanks for um, subscribing to me, and, and, and thanks for watching my videos. I wanted to let you know I just went over 700 subscribers. Uh, that's pretty amazing. I mean, I, I never had a contest. Nobody joined because of the contest. Um, 700 people uh, decided to watch my videos, so I, I'm, I'm very happy about that. And uh, thank you for watching and. Uh, Hey, listen, may we all have some good hunts all spring and summer long. Stand by.